In this video we will learn how to align your pivot point after a 3D scan properly. After you imported your 3D model after your 3D scan, your gizmo and also your pivot point is just somewhere. So what you would like to have, you want to like define this surface as a uh, horizontal surface. And uh, the first thing I draw, I just draw a reference plane, somewhere like this. And uh, this uh, plane is orthogonal to my origin. And uh, I just define this as my reference. I just select my 3D scanned object. I go into a normal align. I just click on this surface, uh, somewhere like this. And you can see this blue arrow. And I just click on my um, uh, reference plane. And you can already see that my uh, scanned object moved. I just go into flip normals. It really depends on uh, uh, how your uh, object is scanned. And this already looks uh, really well. If it's not uh, exactly the way you want to have it, is it still a little bit tilted? You just have to do it several times because also here there are several uh, um, polygons. Not everything is aligned to your surface, but for me this already looks quite good. So what's the next step? The next step is uh, that I just go into a hierarchy. I just say effect pivot point and just say center object. So my pivot point is in uh, uh, the middle, somewhere like this. I just leave this menu. I just delete my plane surface. And uh, here we go. That's really good. And as um, I just want to prepare it for 3D printing, my next step is that I just add a slice modifier on top. I just press the button X. Enter the word slice uh, and just uh, choose slice plane. And uh, when I look at my slice pen, you can just see this slice pen is not orthogonal. It's completely tilted. And what I have to do is um, I just have to go into utilities and into reset X form, reset selected. And I just have to apply my transformation to my modifier stack. So my X form has to be underneath the slice plane, somewhere like this. And if I now go into the slice plane and open my slice plane menu, then it looks really well. Next step is you just go into remove uh, bottom and uh, go into slice plane and uh, remove bottom. And uh, then I can just move up my slice plane somewhere like this. And you can just see that my whole scanning software just disappears. If you think that's too much, then you can also just uh, say that you delete these in edit poly. It's really up to you. And uh, this looks really good. The next thing is my 3D model is still an open C model from underneath. I just add a cap holes and um, yeah, here we go. My top view uh, pivot point looks really good. Pivot point looks really good in front view, and my object uh, lies uh, plain on my uh, origin surface. Thank you. Thanks for watching.